You done with all that yet? Just finished. It takes time to design a look like that. Eh, I've seen worse. So now what? Should I go wait at the front desk with you until it's time to start? Front desk? What do you think I do here? I'm Corey Klein, head recruiter and occasional babysitter of people who don't follow instructions and show up way earlier than they're supposed to. Oh, that Corey. I guess when we were emailing, I just saw your name and assumed that... You know what? It's nice to meet you in person, finally. Go get changed. Then head over to the gym. The other trainees who started last week should be showing up soon. And to clear up any potential confusion on your end, they are men. Got it. Thanks. That is Eric Gabriel right there, guys. Welcome to the My Rise of WWE 2K22. Alright, guys. We are in the My Rise hub. We are just getting started. And guys, before we do anything, I want you to let you know that the Eric Gabriel you are seeing is actually a face scan of me. I tried my best to make it look like me. It is an actual face scan. The hair is not the best choice. Uh, there's not really a better option. So this is the hair we're going with. So we have two people to talk to. We got either... Hector Flores or Paragon J. Pierce. Um, let's see. I'm gonna, you know, I'm gonna talk to Hector first. Let's see what he has to say. Hey, new guy, right? I'm Hector Flores. Welcome to the PC. I'm excited to get going, especially since I heard you started last week. It started here, at least. I've been training in wrestling for years before this. It's part of growing up in Mexico. Are you from one of those famous wrestling families? No, where I'm from, you were either into wrestling or football. Sorry. Oh. <laughs> I chose wrestling. All right, guys. Just letting you know, I'm from the MMA background. That's what I chose. I played soccer when I was a kid, but there wasn't enough punching. So eventually, I got into MMA. There was a lot more punching. So why make the switch from MMA to wrestling? I love fighting, but I got burned out with the long training camps and only getting to fight a couple times a year. Plus, I wanted a new challenge. So I started training for this a few months back, and WWE took notice. That's good. But don't expect this to be easy. Absolutely, You're going absolutely. to have to work as hard or harder than you ever have before to make it to WWE. I realize that. And I respect everything that WWE superstars do. Inside and outside the ring. And I know I can do the same thing, if not better. That's a high bar to yes, set. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. But good luck. Let's go. All right. All right. Looks like we got to talk to Paragon J. Pierce anyway. So let's see what he, he's got to say. Hey, who are you? Who am I? You know, let's say who are you. Let's say who first are day you. training here. Who are you? Seriously? Have you not been watching Japanese wrestling for the past six years? I'm no. Paragon J. Pierce, the biggest free agent WWE signed since AJ Styles. Bigger, actually. I haven't had time to watch Japanese wrestling. I was busy training and fighting in MMA at the highest level in the world. So you're an MMA fighter, huh? Man, you guys are all the same. You come in our sport thinking it's going to be easy. You're in for a real wake-up call. I don't plan on being here very long. They actually should have never sent me here to begin with. But I'm going to take this opportunity to send you running back to whatever MMA promotion you were cut from. All right, all right. Okay, I got you, man. Honestly, man, okay. The way this man is talking, I'm not the biggest fan of, so you know. You remind me of a lot of the see. guys I fought against. All talk. Luckily for them, they don't have to face me anymore. Unfortunately, you do. Yeah. Damn, yeah. Yeah, you're let's go, Gabriel. Okay, ring, which you have very little experience in. You're in my arena now, rookie. And when I'm done with you, you're going to wish you stayed in your lane. We'll see. Oh, he will see. He will definitely see. Oh, there's another person we gotta talk to. Another person we gotta talk to. Uh, his name is Chase. Let's see what he gotta say. I heard you were starting today. Big fan. Are you a referee? No, I'm gonna say thanks. thanks. Kind of wanted to say that. May fan? No, not really. I just love that viral video of the fight where you got knocked out in like two seconds. <laughs> hey, that was only one time. Hilarious. Anyway, I'm actually crossing over from another sport too. I spent some time in minor league baseball. Oh, okay. Really? Who'd you play for? Well, I, I wasn't a player. I was actually a mascot named Ribby. Oh! I was around a ton of guys. Ribby! Ribby! Oh, okay. 
Well, no that way. Counts for something, I guess. Yo. The best part of the job was they used to have indie wrestling shows at the stadium all the time, where I got to rub elbows with legends like Jerry the King Lawler. Yo, that's he found Ribby. Out I was training on the side as a oh wrestler my God. and actually helped me get a shot here. Not that I couldn't have made it on my own. I'm trying. I'm trying to be respectful. You know that this is. Uh, I'm. I'm basically the rookie here, guys. I'm the rookie, so. Even if Lawler helped get your foot in the door, you wouldn't be here if you weren't talented. I'll see you out there in a bit. Sounds good, buddy. Oh, and before I forget, can you sign something for me before you leave today? Oh man. <laughs> uh. Uh yeah. Sure. Just as long as you don't sell it online. Ah well. Then you know what? I can get it some other time. I'm just messing with you. If you can make uh, a few bucks, then good for you. And literally, it might only be a few bucks. See you out there, Jason. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. All right, so it looks like we got DMs. Approach your WWE training the same way you did in MMA, and you'll be a huge success. Be the aggressor and call out the biggest name in the room to show them you mean business. Thanks, coach, but don't uh, but I don't know if that's how things work around here might be smart to keep my head down and get a feel for things before I make any big moves more of a counter-attack approach I'm not really your coach anymore so it's your call how to handle yourself good luck I've always respected your opinion but I'm the outsider here I'm going to keep my mouth shut and earn everyone's respect yes sir you already know chat oh snap Check this out, guys. Look at this. I'd like to officially welcome our newest recruit to the start of his WWE journey. Eric Gabriel, yes, yes sir. You've heard this speech already, so we'll try to make it quick. On our first day, he did the whole ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, children of all ages thing. It was awesome. We'll do the talking, Chase. I was just telling him about your cool DX intro you did. Chase! What Road Dog That's definitely a repeat. Is we are going to give you the foundation to succeed in WWE. What you do with it is up to you. Keep in mind, you will be judged at all times. The big man in the sky is always watching. Not that big man. There's a camera up there with a live feed that goes directly to Triple H's office in Stamford. The coaches and PC staff certainly have input. But ultimately, he'll decide when the time's right to bring the GMs from NXT, Raw, and SmackDown here so you can showcase your talents. All right. I'm ready for that now. Yeah, we know you think that, but it's not your call, big shot. Okay. Well, that man's going to be annoying. Now that all that's out of the way, we're going to start with some one-on-one -on -one matches to see where everyone's at. All right. New guy, since it's your first day, We'll let you choose who you want to face. Oh, do I get to choose? No way. Oh, shoot. Chat, okay, um... Okay, chat, I... I think I gotta go with Paragon Chase Pierce, man. That man was kind of being a dick to me. We, I, we go with him, yeah. Okay, let's get started. Yeah, man. Uh, you know, uh, you know, Chase and Hector are really respectful to Eric Gabriel. I, I don't know about Paragon J. Pierce. I think we got to earn his respect. You know, he's been doing wrestling way longer, so I think it makes sense. All right, let's go, Paragon. Let's go. Oh, snap. By the way, guys, just so you... Oh, man. Just so you know, I did put the difficulty on Legend... Um, because honestly, man, I'm trying to work my way up, you know. I've only played a few Legend matches. I haven't done the best, so... Cut me some slack. And by the way, I did not do my move set or anything like that. It didn't let me do anything. But, uh, guys, let me know in the comments right now. What do you guys think of Eric Gabriel uh, and his uh, look, honestly? Does it look like me? Let me know. Oh, what is this? Oh, you're a Nagi. That was beautiful, actually. Bro, I love the camera cuts in this game, man. I'm really excited for this, though. Oh! Bro, I might want to put that in my move set, not going to lie. But guys, for those who are wondering why I picked the MMA background, it's because I do MMA in real life, and I kind of wanted to go based on a real-life kind of scenario if that were to happen, you know? I don't know if I would want to be a wrestler. Oh, nice counter. Well, that was clean. Can I springboard? Oh, yeah. All right, let's go to the middle rope. What do we got here? I have no clue what is my moveset right now. Oh, all right. Double axe handle. I got the, I got the pinfall. Okay, let's see. Bro, why you have to chill? I'm, tr I'm trying to make an impact here. And see, that, that, I'm blaming the ref on that one, to be honest. I'm blaming the ref on that one. 
But does he got Pete Dunn's moveset? Let's go. Oh, let's bring yeah, let's let's work on the arm. Yeah. How does that fear feel, Paragon? Let's go. How do those elbows feel? How do those elbows feel? You know, let's oh I remember what my finisher is though. Hey, spear connects. By the way, that's not gonna be my finisher but, uh for now, but we'll, we'll see. Oh, he kicked out! He kicked out! Guys, letting you know the spear is not gonna be my actual finisher in the game. Um, but th that's the finisher we're using for now, so just keep that in mind. Oh, spinning back kick. That was actually really nice. All right. Let's go. Oh, nice strike. I'm still working on uh, getting used to the controls, by the way, so keep that in mind. Oh, he going for the pin already? All right. We only gave him one count. Not even close. Oh, you no, 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 no. Oh, shoot! That was a cool transition. That was a cool transition, not gonna lie. Oh, if only I didn't miss that, though. Oh, no, 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 no. He, he countered my sig, man. Oh, there's no way he's going for the pin after that one. Oh, he, he's just trying to make it disrespectful. Oh, yeah, no, only on one count, only on one count. Oh, snap. Oh, he got a finisher, too. Oh, okay, that's not his finisher, right? Okay. Bro, Shawn Michaels in the background, though. I don't know if you guys saw that. That was kind of funny. Oh, snap. Wait, is that his finisher? Oh, that. Oh, shoot. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, that's his finisher. No, that's not good. That's not that good. Bro, I'm not good with these submission things. I'm not I'm not good at these at all. I'm not good at these at all. I'm not good at these. Oh, let's go. Come on. Come on. Come on. Okay. Holy cow, bro. I used to. I prefer the other way to do submission escapes, but. Bro, he's doing a freaking Gargano escape and everything. Like. Let's go. Yeah, 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 yeah. I was in the MMA. I know how to get out of submissions. Let's go. All right, he's in the corner. He's stunned. How do I do a run again? There we go. Yes, sir. Off the ropes. Off the ropes. Beard. That was awesome. That was awesome. Going for the cover. One, two. What? He kicked out again. Okay, luckily we got another finisher. No, no, no. It's all good. It's all good. You know what? Let's go Paragon J. Pierce. Let's go, man. You see, I'm in the corner. We are about to put this match away. I understand why you're in the uh, Indies for so long, but oh, no, no, no. He countered. No, 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 no. Oh, he thought it. He thought wrong. Oh, we got to cover. Oh, snap. Cover. Cover. Oh, come on. Oh, I thought that was it. I thought that was it, man. Did you? That was like 2.9999. He's getting back to his feet. Get caught with a big, big shot. Oh, I pressed circle by accident. I was trying to pin him. I was trying to pin him, chat. Oh, yes, sir. Yes, sir. Oh, no. No, no. Oh, come on. That, that has to be it, chat. I'm pretty sure that's the fourth spear of the match. Come on. Let's go. Eric Gabriel makes a big impact in his first match in the PC. Let's go. All right, chat. We are officially a baby face in the, this series. And again, you guys are allowed to pick if you want to be a face or a heel. I think I want to start out as a face. You know, maybe we could obviously change whenever we want. But for now, we're going to be a baby face. We're talking to Paragon. What does he got to say? Before you say anything, do you really think you just got everything I had? It's obvious I shouldn't be here. So I'm not going to give 100% in a training match against a nobody. Bro, I already know you about to be such an asshole in this series. You know, I'm going to say this. All right. Is that what you're going to tell Triple H? Because he probably won an explanation for why the hottest free agent signing since AJ Styles just lost to a nobody. Yeah, come on, Paragon. Triple H wasn't watching our match. The coaches just say that to scare you rookies. Yeah, sure. You sure. think so? Because I'm pretty sure after I beat you, I looked up at the camera and saw it zooming in on me. Probably Triple H wondering who this rookie was who just showed him they're wasting a crap ton of money on an overhyped bust. Damn! Face me when it really counts, and we'll see what happens. All right, any, Here's the thing. any damn time. I think it already did, and we saw what happened. But I'm happy to give Triple H a replay anytime. Yes, sir. Yes, siree. 
All right, guys, that's going to do it for the first episode of the My Rise series. I hope you guys enjoyed seeing what, what Eric Gabriel looks like and what he is able to do inside the ring. Be aware that there's going to be other episodes coming out very, very soon. I'm trying to make this series be a daily thing, but we'll have to see. But until then, enjoy the rest of your day. It's been EG Flames, and I'll see you guys later.